today I'm at English Garden looking for a replacement, a spearmint plant and a uh, cilantro. So I'm not seeing anything right now. Okay, so I guess I have to look around. Herbs, 99. Yeah, plenty of basil. I'm gonna get some um, people. I'm sorry, I'm gonna get So, let's see here. This is really good. Beaver love it. Okay. This is. Wow. I was like, because I went out with the basil. Today, I was like, ooh, I don't oh, like okay. to have that, but I'm not so gonna. So, let's see where our journey takes us. Well, I couldn't find any spearmint or. Um, cilantro, so I'm getting park over here, getting the garlic chives, the tea time, uh, whatever, um, honey lemonade, and mint mojito. I don't know anything about all, well, I know about the garlic chives because I put it in my bagel. Um, on my bagel, you know, it's kind of filled up with cream teas. But um, I'll try these to see uh, what happens. I got the Miracle Grow potting tool, potting mix. So, and I got indoor. So we'll see. This one got peaceful. bought me one of these cute little things and uh, of course you know I got my miracle Grow potting mix and I had to drive right back up remember when I picked up these scissors I had to drive back after I got home to get them um, the girl said it wasn't left so I don't know if I dropped it on the way to the car or what but I had to go back and pick up get my scissors and so let's review so, I got my mint mojito. Um, I never had a mojito, but it's about to end. We're we, we going to try it. Um, then, I never heard of a rosemary honey lemonade, so we're going to try that too. 
And let's see. What is this? Oh, the garlic chives. We're gonna do that. And here come a motorcycle. Um, and tea time. I don't know what that is, so I'm gonna have to research that. But if I can put it in my tea, that'll be, that'll be cool. I'm sitting on my front porch will be, you may hear things. Oh, and I also bought this for my African Violet. Um, I think, yeah, this is what my boss has. So I'm gonna give it a try because her plants are growing beautifully. But she also have a good spot for them in the office. But anyway, so that's what I got from English Garden. So let's repot. Okay, so this is one of my plants that you saw before, and um, as you can see, um, it's tall. So they're starting to like well, but I think that's when it's like it's time for it to uh, be cut. So all the research I've done, um, it said that it's best to cut where there are four leaves beginning to grow. Um, and that way it'll be able to grow um, well starting to grow I really don't want to okay so let's see so do I cut here do I cut there because it is four here um, and these are big so we're going to cut here and see what happens what the heck because it is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and these are already sprouted, so we're gonna cut here. Am I well, you know what? There's only one way to find out, right? Okay, so oh, mm, they smell delicious. Can you eat these by yourself? So, this is what I cut. And I don't think this is supposed to be here. I think this is something that you need to take off. Because it will sprout into a flower and that'll let you... I think that's an indication to uh, let you know that it can be better. Oh, now that part I didn't get down pat. But at least I have this. Hmm, smell good though. So we'll see what happens. So I'm going to add more f dirt in here. Cause it looks kind of low to me. I don't want to cover. Oh, I don't want to cover up nothing. But I do want it to have enough. I really don't need to put no water in here, cause I watered them yesterday. So I'm going to do the other one and see. Yeah, I think I did that right. If not, we will find out, won't we? Okay. So now I'm going to try to do the next one. Now, as you can see, these are, yeah, it's time for this sucker to get cut. Look at that. And it's starting to curl right here. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, and I, I think this is that flower. I don't know. Take it down anyway. So this one is challenging because it looks like <sighs> it's growing. I don't really see any short ones. Well, these don't look like they fully, but this, oh Lord, I don't know what to do. Um, okay, okay. All right, so one, two, three. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll cut from here, but these are big down here, whatever. Okay, so I'm going to, okay, wait, oop, okay. Oops, see, the leaves are falling. Okay, um, these are little. So maybe I'll cut right here and let these grow. But don't, aren't these big? I should probably pluck them. I'm gonna see anyway. But anyway, I'm gonna cut here and see what happens. So here we go. But these look, I don't know. These look kind of big. Well, you know what? 
won't know until yeah we'll see okay so I'm gonna add some dirt in here because I see some roots some roots I can never really say that word some roots okay so again I watered this yesterday so I'm not in this I don't know if okay I see holes in the bag so are we supposed to water the bags that have like the soil bags are they supposed to be watered because this bag of um, potting mix is wet so are we supposed to wet them like put water on them I just don't know but I have noticed that there are holes in the bag Yes, let's see. Let's see, there are holes in the bag. So are we supposed to water the bags? And if so, why? We need to find that out. Why else would they have holes in them and the bag be moist? I mean really moist. I mean it's bad. Okay. And here's the other pot. I don't think it's ready. I don't think it's ready. I put two in one pot. <laughs> um, it doesn't look like it's ready. It's not six inches. They said um, to wait till they get six inches, then cut. So um, I'm gonna wait. And if it is six inches, oh well. It's gonna have to get tall like the other ones. It ain't six inches, is it? No. Ooh, look at that one. I think I should take that one. You know what? Nope. Let it be. Okay. You know, I think I should have probably... I'm going to add some dirt in here, too, a little bit. I kind of think I should have um, made this higher. You know? I think it's too low in the pot. This one got a hole in it. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with all this basil either. I'm just doing something. Trying to test the waters. Okay, well, let me put these on the window sill. Okay, so <laughs> excuse me. This is the garlic chives that I bought last time and this is the same thing so they're doing pretty good I'm waiting until they get a little taller before I start cutting around because it's not that many going over so I don't think it's ready yet and if it is I'm gonna wait till it get to where I want it to go now this is what I bought today so these are garlic chives um, they look thick totally different but anyway I did I potted that today and this is the rosemary plant honey lemonade I can't wait to find out how to really you know use that and of course this is the parsley parsley doing really good uh, it's not tall enough for me to attack yet so I'll wait okay this is my mint mojito I'm looking forward to finding out how to make one of those <laughs> And here's the tea time. I don't really know what that is, but of course, you know, I'm going to find out. So I, these are the ones I got today from English Garden. And I'm going to, you know, watch and give them a test once they hopefully grow the way they should. But I potted those today. These are the basils that I cut. I thought I had a stick for those. Maybe not. Okay, and this is the other basil. Now, I got all these basils right here at the same time. This one right here, I don't know if it's trying to tell me something. Wait, yeah, I don't know if it's trying to tell me something, but uh, it's being kind of stubborn. Are you being stubborn? Or you like, look, I'm gonna do me. You grow at your pace, boo, grow at your pace. 
how we get down. Um, I'm not looking forward to this little cleanup. I just don't like it. But what else? Be basable. Okay. Here's my cactus plant. Okay. Oops. And it's doing pretty good. Uh, it's still, for some reason, it's still kind of damp. So I'm not going to add any water to it at all. Um, I did feed it last week, so I'm not going to give it anything until next week. Um, look at that. Now, I don't know if I'm getting geeked for no reason, but look at, look at that little red dress. I never saw one. Wait, I never saw one of those before. Is that my friend and her motorcycle crew? Oh, okay. She looks so cute on her motorcycle. Um, so, I'm happy to see a little red, well, pink. We'll see. And here's my African violet. It hasn't um, died on me. And it's dry, but it's... Hmm. It's dry up here. But I think I'll water it. I'm going to water it the same time I water this one. Because I don't want to water it too much. Because remember, I think that's where the yellow spots came from. Me watering too much. So, but it's still doing pretty good. It's not leaning or anything. So, we'll see. Hopefully one day it'll start blooming. But right now, as long as it's healthy, I'm okay with that. But I did buy it some food, so I'll feed it next week. Because I fed it last week. Okay.